Hey everybody, Mr. Linky here, and today I will be testing out my Pagat 308R Hybrid. Just got this thing fully maxed out, and sorry if you hear wind, it's my computer. I'll get into that in a second, but for this car coming in, the rally update, I don't get why it doesn't have gravel tires, like, so much. The car is perfect for it. 596 horsepower 1,271 kilograms so I don't know it max is pretty fucking awesome for rallying but yeah but anyway yeah if you hear like whistle like wind sounds or like clicking and shit that's just my computer and my hard drive I'm downloading some stuff and I still have to find a 32-bit architect recorder because I don't know, like, I need 62-bit just to fucking get this recorder that I have now. And that was my old PC, so I'm gonna have to either switch out the motherboards or... I don't know, I'll figure it out. But, in the meantime, we got this. So, let's head to Blue City and test this bitch out. And if you're new here, I don't touch anything, so... Everything's just stock with ABS, steer assist, and traction control off. But, I hope everyone's day's been going great. And let's get at this. So much good to actually say about this car yet it has short gears and everything like it it grips pretty amazing it handles pretty good it controls really well but certain things like that like that last big roundabout well that big fucking bend at the end of blue city there it, it for some reason the wider the turn is the slower so I don't know, I'm curious because obviously this car came with the update so it's going to be put on a rally course and I don't know, I, I hope with a bit of practice that this car could actually rip through it because it, I don't know, like on gravel it already seems to want to fishtail sometimes and 
it already has that rally aspect to it so who knows maybe this car will be decent and i'll definitely make a video on that in the near future as well if you buy this car i guess i should show this because it is one of the only cars that does it but you can change the color to anything and the white the red and the black will stay i don't know if other cars were updated like that as well as like i'm gonna be doing another car video soon just because it went from d spec to r spec and i haven't really actually tested it maxed yet so it'll be interesting to see the difference if someone actually tested it maxed with it being d spec to be able to tell the difference but hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time peace